Good morning. Got the birds chirping. It's about 5.30. Ugh, a little chill in the bones. And it is just beautiful. Just a wonderful, wonderful way to wake up. Sun's just cresting over those mountains. And it looks like it's going to be a beautiful day ahead. I, um, I'm pretty much right on the, I'm pretty close to the Idaho border in northern Nevada. And I had trouble finding the route that I was going to, so I was going to go to Glen Ferries and miss the uh, beginning of the Idaho backcountry. But then I found this dirt road here. I can't remember the name. I probably should know, but there was a sign that said uh, Jar Jarbidge. Jarbidge, 46 miles. So I've been on this, I was on this, I don't know, maybe 10, 20 miles tops. No more than 10, I don't think. To Jarbidge. And that's the start of the uh, Idaho backcountry, so. Kind of lucked out in finding that. So, I'm looking to put on some good miles today, I hope. But the hotel was nice, huh? Can't beat the price. Nice big mountain up here. Had quite a bit of cow, curious cows. Had a lot of cows around me last night. When I was setting up the tent, they were all over here watching me. I guess if you're out here in the middle of nowhere, you'd be um, interested in anything, right? I mean, there's not a whole lot going on out here. I did hear one car pass last night, and I heard one about uh, half an hour ago pass by. So not much traffic going by at all. Bike's in uh, great shape. It's uh, it's a little head twitchy, left to right. And I don't know if it's because I got fuel all the way filled up in those tanks. I'm thinking about ordering a steering stabilizer. I'm not sure, but it's uh, it's a little unstable off road. I mean, on these gravel roads, and I haven't really gotten into any technical stuff yet, so. I'm definitely going to just take it slow and um, the main mission is to stay upright and finish this thing, but uh, I may have a steering, order a stable, steering stabilizer and, and have that brought to, uh, have that delivered to Fairbanks and have it put on up there, but haven't quite figured that out yet. Well. First day of off-road, technically. I mean, I pulled in last night when it was dirt, but I'm not liking this wire out here, but I'm not quite sure what to do with it. Maybe I can zip tie it to here a little later. If it looks like more of a problem. But, and these knobs keep loosening up and I'm afraid to really torque them down because, man, it's just, like plastic, I don't want to break them. But they loosened up on me twice. Got some little rattle going on. But whatever. Run what you brung. Right? Got my map. Seven a.m. man, on the road at seven. Impressive. Make sure I got all the straps tight. On my way to job. 
bridge. Announcement. Whoa, that was snow. That wasn't the announcement. That was pretty cool though. Can't believe there was snow right there. It's not even that cold. Um, I've always said that Utah was my favorite state to ride in. Idaho just very well be my favorite state. And this is unbelievable. So beautiful. What a place. I'm so glad I did this. I'm so glad I did it on this bike too. Not gonna work out some kinks with it, but man, it's so nice having a light, lightweight. I'll take the sacrifice on the street to have, to have a light adventure bike. If she feels heavier than she's ever been, packed up and stuff, a little, a little squirrely in the corners and stuff when I get sideways, you can feel the weight, but... My first water crossing! Alright! Not really. Just a puddle. That's my announcement. That's my big announcement. Coming from Elko, I just came uh, from up up that mountain pass. Uh, the peak was 8,500 feet. There was snow up at the top, very little, but uh, for July, that's pretty impressive. 
Anyway, at the bottom, when you descend off the mountain pass from Elko, off the 225, beautiful ride. Little outhouse here, bathroom. Surprisingly, really, really clean. So I don't know if there's, uh, this must be some campsites right here or something. But um, just for reference, in case you need one, that's where it is. There's a, I don't know if you can hear, there's a nice stream down there. Let's see if we can take a look at that. This will be our first bridge, water crossing. <laughs> 